Captain, our objective has always been to disrupt the word of Blake and disable the orbital guns. This mission is going to be hard, but you're tough enough, right? Weren't you just telling me that last night, cowboy? <clears throat> Sirs, the job is this. Sink the barges and any patrol boats guarding them before they make it out to sea. They're carrying parts for the orbital guns, so this is critical. The problem is going to be the terrain. Water's gonna slow you down, so keep an eye out for shortcuts over dry land. Now this whole planet is in enemy territory, so watch out for other enemies besides those patrol boats. Get to it, mech warrior. Time to get wet. Come sail away, come sail away. Come sail away with me, lads! Billy12510, welcome you back to more Let's Play Mech Assault! I like this mission a bit. Oh, I like this game in general, so... I guess that goes without saying. But, last time we destroyed a bunch of Word of Lake Air Forces, so now we're gonna go after their sea forces! You know, this makes a lot of sense. I guess. Uh, destroy all barges! Five barges are being used to move parts for the orbital gun. Send them to the bottom. And destroy escort visual vessels. We're reading eight enemy escort craft. Sink them all. So... We really need to get this job done because the orbital guns are our, are our first priority here. They're the reason we were sent to Helios in the first place. Now, what Foster didn't tell you... That we actually got a new mech for this mission. Every time you get a new mech, you will unlock the variant of that mech in the next mission that comes after it. For the most part. In this case, we have the Belial, a variant of the Uziel, is built to feel the pair of formidable Gauss rifles. It's got the same armor and speed ratings as the Uziel does, and it has jump jets, but it has no defense. Uh, armor ability. It has a single pulse laser, a single crossbow missile, and twin Gauss rifles. The main attraction. The Gauss rifles are the single most powerful ballistic type weapon in the game. However, they're only limited to two per mech. And there's a good reason. They're not only are they incredibly powerful, but when they're upgrade, they're they're incredibly easy at knocking over mechs temporarily to deal so much hell. Belial is really good, and I'm going to use it for this mission because I've always used it for this mission. I always just... That's always just how I've played. Anyway, a convoy of barges is carrying parts for your orbital guns. Sink the barges before they reach the sea. I'm reading the convoy directly ahead. You should have visual. Get them! Don't fall too far behind! So, if you couldn't tell from that, you'll know immediately why I love the Gals rifles so much. They just destroy everything. Now, the water will slow you down a bit, but since all of your mechs have jump jets equipped, you should be able to get around it, more or less. You can also shoot these down. Sometimes they have, like, turrets and things equipped to them. And you can use them to sink some sh some of the ships as well. Uh, let's just take this land shortcut here for now. You might think a speedy mech is good for this mission, and it could be. But, uh, Uziel and Belial are both adequately handled to deal with this. If you shoot one of the turrets, the entire railing won't come down, by the way. The problem with the Gauss rifles is that they take a long time to reload. Especially compared to other weapons. I think they have the second longest reload time of any weapon in the game. Anyway, that's three of the five barges already. Wow. So, Captain, ever get the feeling these people don't like you? Just a little bit. This is a Uller variant called the Mad... Not the Mad Dog. The Kid Fox. It has a single post laser and a Warhammer missile. A Warhammer missile. Oh, it also has no SIG. It's basically this. It's time delayed. The longer you charge it up, the longer it takes to detonate. But the longer you charge it up, the more damage it will deal when it explodes. It's also dumb fire. So it has no lock-on system. So it is not affected by AMS systems. 
All in all, it's pretty good, but it's nothing the Belial or Uzeal can't take out. God, I'm thinking of another mech that ha has um, Warhammer missiles. Those escort vessels are one of our objectives, but until you take out the barges, they won't be recognized as such. Oh god, a lot of tanks. Being shot up by this bridge. Well, I'll just destroy the bridge. Really should have taken that land shortcut. I'm not worried about losing this mission, dude. Due, due to, um... Like, being destroyed. More, so, I'm more so worried about losing this mission due to the timeout. Because you have a pseudo time limit. If any of the ships reach the sea, the mission... It's an automatic mission failure. What the hell is shooting at me? Wow. Okay, now we move the Icarus and press our attack. Captain, we're on the move as soon as you get back. Wait. Are you serious? It only took me seven minutes to do. Not even. What the fuck? It took me six minutes to beat that mission. It's really quick. Wow. Um. I'm feeling what to five ten. I guess I'll see you guys next time. Because after this, a cutscene's going to play, so. What is this? That's Alpha Lance. Where are they? Quiet. Mercenary. Watch your infidel brethren. Watch and learn. Straight.